Testimony resumes tomorrow in the intoxication manslaughter trial of Luis Torres. He's charged for the 2020 crash that killed BPD officer Sheena Yarbrough Pal. Today, prosecutors painted a picture of an 18 year old who had a reputation for partying. That revelation came when a recording of a phone call was played in court between Luis Torres and his parents. That call was actually made on a state troopers phone while Torres was in the hospital. The conversation in Spanish was translated for the jury. Torres repeatedly said, I'm sorry, telling his parents, quote, you told me many times this would happen. I didn't listen. Jurors also heard from a woman who hosted a party the night of the crash. She admitted to serving Torres a beer, not knowing he was only 18. She testified he later dropped the beer and actually fell off of a flower pot. She testified, quote, I thought he was drunk and was worried about him leaving. I offered to allow him to sleep on the couch, but he refused. Jurors also had to look at photos from Officer Yarbrough Powell's injuries and hear from a pathologist who performed the autopsy. Obviously, sitting through anything like this is extremely emotionally, mentally, and even physically exhausting. So far, the defense has continued to highlight the fact that the officers were not wearing seat belts. Today, during cross-examination, they pressed the pathologist about Officer Yarborough Powell's head injuries. Now, we're going to be back in court when testimony resumes in the morning. And, of course, we'll post updates throughout the day on 12newsnow.com and on our app.